Hey, love bugs. This is Frost and Mega Chew. One more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored, and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, to my growing extended beautiful family, as always, thank you so much for the love and support. So, with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been, um, watching my videos for a while and have not already please drop a line i would love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me and if you feel like the videos just give you an uplift or just give you a vibe you know go ahead please put the plus the thumb thumb uh the like button and as well as you know please go ahead and share so um the video that i'm doing today is called twin flame 101 hey hoka's evolution is nigh it um now is either now or never um, it's just getting way too real showing up for yourself like never before it is this is a time if you've been sleeping on yourself now this is time to wake the f up you know it's just you 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 know what your story is you know what your glory it, it, you're anticipating your glory you know you know that you're expecting those different things in life and these are those times where it's showing you uh, you know what got you here you know what different things you have gone through you know what different you know pains that you're going through you know um being able to have to say okay you know what hurt your heart yeah these are the times where you under construction and it is just showing you that uh this is at the time where you reinvent yourself you know being able to appreciate what your story has unfolded as of now you know now it's just like you you heading towards that new chapter of yourself where it's just like we're not going to use the same excuses of why you know we're sad why we're mad why we're depressed you know why certain things happen the way it is why are we still in this situation you know whatever it, it's just like we when i'm seeing it and this is how i'm seeing it right now this stuff is crazy it's like you see yourself and you see the part of yourself that is just like this trying to break away and that fear comes up, you know, and you don't know where that fear is coming from. And it's just like we've been living at that frequency for so long. And you're starting to see that everything is starting to fall apart from that situation. And everything is unfolding and in a crazy way. And a lot of times when we're still in our vibration of being maybe depressed about certain things that has taken place. Or we feel like things ain't speeding up. Things ain't moving fast enough or whatever. But it's just like universe is trying to tell us, you know, thank you spirit. That you're saying you don't know what's taking place over on this other side. You don't know what's taking place in the realm. You don't know what's going on just because you can't see it. You just don't know how things are unfolding for you and it, it's going to feel weird you're going through heavy challenges right now and those heavy challenges are really trying to show you this is what you needed this is at that time where all that pain hurt whatever it is that, that holds a narrative negative nar negative narrative is coming down this is that time to build these boundaries up to where you you know what is not worth your daggone energy anymore not not right now but anymore you know what you shouldn't entertain what people you shouldn't entertain you know letting go of things that is is you know letting letting go of energies that connect with you is um that is just okay with misunderstanding you you know i'm when i tell you changes is hitting deep and you know you're going through it and i know with my situation i know i see things going on on my channel i mean it's just like um, certain energies that I refuse to even acknowledge through or refuse to even speak their name you know if you've been with me for a while you already know who I'm talking about because I know I make me a whole video about that as well as um um, I made a post on my community uh, my community section of my channel uh, almost close to a year ago where this 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 energy this energy, you know, is bringing little people in to listen and watch my videos and bringing that name up just to see what I'm going to say. Baby, I'm not about to give you that. I'm not about to give you that smoke. Even though you looking for it, I'll, I'll sit it right back. I'll rebuke you. <laughs> you know, I'm like, no, because I was just like, I brought it up. You know, we, it was, we were talking about it. I think I was talking about it in a video. And it was funny how one of my brothers done sit up here and they mentioned that exact person. They knew exactly who I was talking about. And I was just like, damn. I didn't even mention the person's name and you knew exactly what I was talking about. And then it was like, it wasn't no co coincidence that somebody would bring, act like they need assistance and they need help. And all of a sudden they bring up that person's name. Baby, they know what they are. They know who they are. You know, sad to say, you know, when people go over to that, that vibration over there, 
They don't know, and I just pray for the people that don't know about themselves. They don't. I, I don't deal with people that manipulate. I ain't got time for be regurgitating anybody else. Anytime, you know, you come here with me, uh, if it's something I heard from somebody else, I'm not going to take credit for that. I'm like, oh, you know, it, it'll be a different story if it's like, Dag, I really forgot about who I, you know, who I stole that, uh, that, that uh, quote from or whatever. But I'm just like, bad, my bad, whatever. But other than that, I'll be like, oh, I got this from such and such, you know, or whatever. And then it's just like the energy. I said stuff is getting real. I'm like, when you stoop into levels, I'm like, dude, you, you got more views and more. You know, <laughs> you get more views and you got more subscribers. Even you did it with it fake and fraudulent ways. You know, hey, you got them. Keep that over there. I'm I'm real right here. I'm transparent over here. You know, that's it, it's like you an energy killer. You know, and it's just me. I'm a truth filler. You know, I just I just don't have time. But it was just like I appreciate that you you I mean you make me feel important. You know I, I I'm just like when you coming over here because I was like I wasn't even thinking about you until I brought it up randomly. But it was just like Lord and it was just our and I think that was just in, see see my nose is itching so that was just telling me that oh yeah that trigger over here watching. He looking but he know he can't comment so he sends his groupies over here to do that and I'll just be laughing. I'm just like Lord Jesus, I'm praying for you. But you know, it, it's on, on a positive note. I said I ain't even about to. I ain't even about to get that smoke. But I said I'm not even gonna root your name because I knew that's what you were hoping I would do. I'm not about to do that. <laughs> I'm not about to do that. But it, it's just like you going through things, and and when when you see the shade is being thrown, execute it. Execute it. You you don't even have to go through it. Just execute it. And these are those times. I'm on me a new vibe. I'm on me a new view. If you ain't supporting me, hey, you ain't got to support me. But stay the hell on. <laughs> Keep the hell on. You, you know, it's like, I, I'm going to let you watch, but that's going to be it. But it, it's just like coming in that vibration where I wanna, I'm want i being there for people that want to be here. You know, I want to be with, uh, you know, being able to help support each other that we're on that vibration of help and support. Even if you don't know exactly where you're trying to be, you don't know where you're wanting to be right now because you're trying to find your way. Hey, I'm all here for it. I want to be there. You know, that's why I love to be able to share my experiences, being able to be open and transparent about that. Because there'll be days that we feel lost. And universe and God is trying to show you this is where I need you to be right now. This is I need you to just show up for yourself. I need you to be present. I know the things that you're dealing with is leaving you in a whole bunch of confusions. I know you're getting fed up. I know you're feeling like breaking down. I know you're tired. But these are those things I'm creating something within you. It may you know you won't get that clarity, and you going you going through a whole bunch of series of tests right now. A whole bunch of series of tests. But this is showing you exactly who you are. Are you going to allow yourself to entertain nobodies? Are you allowing yourself to entertain negativity? Are you allowing yourself to entertain distractions? These are those things where I'm showing you where your heart is at. Because when you know you're into something that is very crucial. This is very crucial for your your your. Uh, your path that you're going on and these are the different things that's taking place into your life where you know I'm gonna send different things around your way to help you learn but in the same way devil sending something that's going to be trying to make you second guess yourself these are the different things that is going to make you want to fold make you want to give up make you say every you know it's like I give up I'm done I quit you know this is becoming too much and this is like no this is when you strike when the iron is hot you know, you are on fire. <clears throat> you are really on fire, fam. You are really on fire. And it's just like, as soon as I said that, oh, yes. Okay, thank you. Thank you, gift. Thank you, God, for that gift. You are really on fire right now. You know, you going on these different things. And it was just like, you know, uh, when I had that thick, quick thought about that, I was just like, you know, what took place. And it was just like, you really doing something. You know when you really doing something when it when it's just like when people go about things in a not real way, you're gonna intimidate the hell out of some people. You know, you don't have enemies watching you, some that you know, some that you don't know. You don't have enemies out there that you don't even you know, you never knew it that was there. But then there's also people that is in you know, up in the in the in the nosebleed section, and I'm talking about the VIP. Not the, the nosebleed section of the haters, but the VIP that's up here looking at you. 
just seeing it's like dad you know that person who took so many ills and they coming back then i had so many setbacks and now they they showing up these are those things is where i'm telling you life is getting real for you so when it's getting real for you that means it's gonna get crazy for you and you got to be able to buckle it was like Buckle your seat belts, buckle your seat belts, fam, because you needing it right now. And it's just so much stuff that's going on because I feel this fuel right now. And it's just like it's crazy because this is it's like all you see is fire right here. I know you really can't see it. But um uh, that's what I'm talking about. When it showed it was just like, you know, universe is telling me you, you on fire right now. And when you on fire right now, stuff gonna come at you, stuff gonna get really get crazy because this is where I'm testing you at. I want you to see where your where where's your heart at. You know where your heart at. You know you got you got love and support with heart, and then you got haters with heart. You gonna need them both to fuel yourself. This is where I'm fueling you from. That fear you got, you gonna fuel from it. That hate you got, you gonna feel from it. And then it's gonna get to that point where you gonna know you needed those disappointments in your life because it showed you how much you you gonna need to show up for yourself. If somebody ain't showing you love, that's okay. You take all that lack and bring it to yourself. You know, everybody's doing them. Now it's time to do you. This is time for you to put yourself first. This is that, that time to put you on the top of that pedestal. You don't put everything and everybody on top of that pedestal. And you left yourself down down here in the trenches. Now it's time for you to uh -uh, climb. Climb, brother, uh, brother, climb. P climb, sister, climb. These are those different things that's showing up where... And it's like when I see it, I'm seeing numbers. And when I'm seeing numbers, it's like, you know, it's just like those numbers that's going on. Like, um, God, dog, I don't know if it's like, you know, the ones on Wall Street, you hear, you know, it'll be like one of those little noises. And it's showing you, it is like the wait is over. This is that, that time you on a whole new level and don't even realize it. And it's just like things were seeming cloudy to me. Now it's just like. Damn, you getting all type of clarity right now. It, it's you g doing good. You going to do a lot of things that's going to make somebody uncomfortable. You going to sit up here and project light that's going to make other people uncomfortable. It's okay. But then there'll be people like, man, you finally getting it. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. This is where you needed to be, fam. I've been waiting on you to get here. You know, I've been waiting on you to get here. You know, and different things is coming up. It's like, well, I seen it. Remember, I was telling you about that. Because I see so much potential in people that I talk to. I, I see so much p potential in people I don't talk to. And I love it. Because it's like when I said that. It, it's just like even the people I don't talk to. I'm seeing them and they showing up for themselves. And I'm so proud of them. I'm so proud of them. Whether, whether or not how they feel about me. I'm proud of you fam. I'm so proud of you. Because you showing up for yourself. A lot of times you have to be. Uh, disconnected. A lot of times you had to be counted out. A lot of times you have to be put by yourself because this is at that time you don't have so many different distractions. And not saying that people in your life is the distraction, but it takes you away from what you need to do for yourself is within a whole. You know, because a lot of times if we have a lot of people around us, you 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 putting so much in here, so much in here, and then when it's time for you to put back in your own bowl, there's nothing left. Now this is at that time where God is like, I needed you to be by yourself because I needed you to focus on you. I needed you to sit up here and do what you need to do for you. You know, these are the different things that I have going on in your life. It may feel like I hate you right now. It may feel like I hurt you right now. But this is all about love. This is all about strength. This is all about consistency. And this is where he's talking about evolution is now. You know, you're going through a huge change right now. You're going through these things where it feel like you're going to have little hiccups. That's okay. That's okay. You're going to have moments where you just like, why, God, why? You know, I keep going off for all these things. And these things get, just keep happening for me. But now it's at that point. You know, it's going to be, it, it's going to be when you see things are intolerable. And you're like, nah, I ain't going to go for the disrespect. Nah, I ain't going to go for the manipulation. Nah, I'm not going to go for, you know, you trying to trigger me. No, no, and no. I'm like, you know, I like Courtney Carter. <laughs> I'm like, no, no, no. You know, I ain't going through all that. You know, but it, it's just like. Going, going through all those different things in your life it is just showing you, you know, uh, the changes done changed you for the better. Even though it may not feel like it, this is at that time where it's going to make sense to you. 
It's going to make sense to you, sis. It's going to make sense to you, bro. It's going to make sense to you. It may not be feeling like that right now. Because I'm feeling it. It was just like, dang, I felt so lost for a minute. And then I pressed pause for the cause. Then I'm like, I can see clearly now the rain is gone. I can feel all the obstacles in my way. You're getting the hell out your way. You know, you're going through that. And it's just at that time, like, I had to have those obstacles. I had to have those setbacks. I had to have those different people that was just not right for me. You know, and I just wasn't right for them. And it's just at that time, now, you you know, you may have held a grudge. You may have taken it personal. Now it's just like God was telling you, I've been told you, those people has already made that point in your life. They already made that connection in your life. Release them. Release them. If until you release them, it's going to get like that. It's going to feel like people going to treat you all type of way, you know, and it's going to be at that point when you know you start loving yourself, you ain't going to tolerate that type of misfunction. You ain't going to tolerate those different things and you needed that. This is what I was telling you. And then it's just like all these different things is coming on where life is about to get really beautiful for you. It was being ugly for a minute, but now it's life is about to get beautiful for you. You needed those different things into your heart into your mind you know and it may have made you feel like you know you weren't you know you were really going all over the place and maybe you were all over the place because you didn't know what what you were really trying to understand but you couldn't really understand you know and these are those different things that you needed to happen because sometimes you gotta look into that mirror and say you needed that you needed that whether or not it's like tears coming down your face you needed that because it shows you hey come from the best best of the chest death of the chest you needed that. You needed that. Because you know when you you know when God is placing something so small, it's like microscopic. And he's about to use you for that tool to make something blow the fuck up. Okay? You I mean you are you're a whole new mood of flex right about now. And you're gonna keep doing that. When you keep unloading things and keep downloading, uploading, upgrading, purging, cutting corners, cutting corners on cutting tides. And that's what I mean. Cutting to corners on cutting tides. And you're going to look at things and say, damn, I really needed that in my life. Because this is showing me. Because you, you are really, you got that beast in you that's waiting. And it's just like, you know, I be, you know, I'll be one of those moments like, I've been waiting for you. You know, you finally here. And, and, and you know, it's like God and the, all up in there, they up there parlaying already for you. Because you know in your heart, even though you may be mad, you may be frustrated, you may be confused, you may be giving, God's trying to show you, I'm tired, we know you're tired, like, yeah, okay, whatever, you know, and it's like, we know, you mad at me right now, but it's okay, I'm prepping you for something, and when I'm saying I'm prepping you, I'm prepping you for something, I'm giving you mantras, I'm giving you affirmations, I'm giving you different archangels right now to keep showing up in your life. You know, and it's just like a lot of people seeing in that third eye transformation, upgrade level up P pressing on the gas accelerate it, it, you're going through mass acceleration right now and when you're going through mass acceleration right now that best be right and you want to fight the devil you're like come on i'll be meeting you at three o'clock <laughs> you, you really make him nervous devil did not you know what i mean hell yeah i'm talking to you yeah i'm talking to you you know, and then you be like, you're appreciating everything that he brought towards you because it really, really showed you. And this is not about boosting and bragging and all that. No, I ain't got time for all that. I ain't the ego dead. But it's just that that fact, when you're seeing different things for what they truly are, you won't have things that come against you and it's going to hit you and it's going to hit you hard. It's going to hit you in ways where it's like they know what you hold dear to you and they about to rip that apart. You know what holds dear to you, and they're gonna rip it apart. And it'll be, it, it's just not like you saying you hate somebody, or you, I mean, because it's just like you gotta let go of love. I'm like, damn, there gotta be love there for me to let go of it. I can still let go of it, but can I just let go of it just the way it is? <laughs> it was like, I ain't gotta put no love in it. But it's like, no, you letting go with it with love because you gotta love what that hurt felt for. It put meaning behind that, that, that situation of transition. You letting go of that anger you have towards people with love. Why well, I ain't got that love? Let that love because it showed you to love yourself. There's gonna people. There's gonna be people that's gonna overlook you and they're gonna keep overlooking you until God puts you in position. And then it's gonna be too late. 
these are those different things that's coming up into your life where you gonna appreciate every single thing that you done went through and it's just like so much stuff is coming up right now because i was always wondering i'm like why are these certain things coming up you really about to make me catch a case and it's like no it's just showing you where you still holding on to things that is showing you where even though you thought you forgave certain situations and certain people this is showing you Take your energy back. Take your power back. Whatever left that they don't instill in you, you kindly give that mess back. Return the sender without rescinder. You know, and you know, you ain't got hey, you ain't gotta send me no consolation, no confirmation that you don't gave that back. No, I'm giving it back and do a 21 gun salute. I'm good. And you're doing that. And this is at that time, it's like when I'm saying this, when I tell you it's just like I feel my heart cracking. And it's like tingling. And that makes me feel good. And it's really making me feel good. And it's just at that time where it's showing you this is what you needed in life. A lot of times you're going to be pressed with confusion. You're going to be compressed with anger. You know, things that it was it, it was just like, why things are not showing up for me in my life? Because you weren't showing up for you. You were sleeping on you. Why does it feel like things are going slow? Because you moving that way. And it's not saying that every little baby step don't count. Because it do. But it's just the fact is, are you putting in? The belief behind the fact is the little things that you're doing is going to manifest into something big. Because there will be sometimes we can be doing it it's just like, okay, I did it. But you ain't do it with heart. You ain't put strength behind it. Even when you're tired, put some strength behind it. Be like, ugh. <laughs> you're going to be tired as hell. And be like, ugh. You need to do that. But these are those times that's showing you, showing up, showing out for yourself. This is telling you to put it all in, fam. This is at that time where things are starting to open to you. Regardless on what's going on right now, way it may seem, things is opening up for you. Allow that to be gone. But I hope you were able to resonate with the content of my video, y'all. I would love to give a post notification shout out to Thomas Wood uh, Woodward. Much love to you and welcome to the fam. So good to have you. Nye Nightlinger, much love to you. Welcome to the fam. Uh, Storm and... Uh, Um, Christina Valdez and um, that's all I know. Right? Oh yeah, Christina F Flaherty too. Much love to you, well and good to you. Um, whatever you are manifesting into your life, fam, I'm sending so much beautiful blessings to you. I know you've been probably working hard nonstop. There'll be days that you want to give up. Don't give up. Don't give in. This is your moment. This is your time. This is your season. Keep pushing. Be persistent and consistent. So it's just like when those doors open for you, I'm sending so much love that it's like it's going to be something that God is just going to make you bring to your knees. And go ahead and keep going. The devil wants you to quit today because your blessing may be opening doors for you tomorrow. Keep going. Keep going. It's going to come in when you least expect it. And even through social distancing, make sure you give out love, light, positivity, words, vibes, frequency. Uh, you never know. Those things will really take somebody a long way. And just because you took the time to do that, it's going to take you even further. And um, I also leave my contact information in the description box below. Uh, it's all about helping people further their purpose in life or giving them a deeper other understanding of their purpose. You know, I love to be able to participate in those different things. And um, I help out the best way I possibly can. Whatever we speak on is confidential. And, you know, I leave my link to my podcast as well. And if you uh, feel generous enough to drop a donation, Cash App is there as well. So you see me on my next video. Much love. Peace.